Hi guys, Markeisha here. Today I will be sharing with you a project that I created for a collaboration that Betty Scrap Passion Zero One has been having on her channel. Um, she created the Disney Saturdays and it has been going on since June. And today is actually the last installment of the series. I would like to just say thank you to Betty. Uh, this has been a very, very fun series. Um, I have really had fun creating Disney pro projects and just getting back in the hang of things. So I'm going to go ahead and jump right into today's uh, projects. All right, so this is the first project I'm going to share with you guys. I uh, created this Mickey uh, memory decks on my uh, Cricut, and I really love how it turned out. I was able to uh, customize it, and um, what I did was I just took the Rolodex um, cutout, and then I welded the Mickey image to it and um, just, you know, personalized it and made it a shaped uh, Rolodex. Um, I just have some stickers there that says good vibes and friends are forever. I have the little sweet little bear, uh, Mr. Snuggles, that we all love by Cottage Cuts. Of course, I made uh, this a girl and added a bow to it. I have just some stickers here with some little... Um, ice cream or a little sundae and then I have some little donuts there with some glitter paper that's added to there a little seam binding and just lots of layering to that this is really a fun size memory decks um, as you can see it's fairly large and I can add my information to the back and just give this to someone so I really really like how this turned out okay so I had this die here in my stash for quite some time uh, it's a little die here if you guys can see that I picked this die up from Aliexpress and I just wanted to play with it now of course a disclaimer here when I purchased this I thought that it was a lot bigger than what it was I'm sure you guys have that have ordered um, from Ali um, have experienced that where maybe you've ordered a die and then you get it and it's much smaller than what you thought but anyway I wanted to just play with it um, anyway and just see how it cuts out and um, actually it's super cute and so it's really tiny guys but I use the Frank Garcia like magic paper I just made my own embellishment here with some crepe paper and just you know layered it up with some chipboard pieces here and added a sticker that says create happiness I just stuck some tissue paper in here um, it's like a little um, bag that you can have to just have some little goodies um, I'm not quite sure what you would be able to kind of put it put in this maybe if you were hosting in a little baby shower or birthday or something like that and you wanted to add some candies or something like that um, it would be a fun die for that but um, still I think it's a super cute die I uh, wish it was a little bit bigger but it still um, I think it was really cute okay all right and so the next thing I'm going to show all right is this suitcase so I finally created one and I was so excited. Um, I actually cut this one off of my silhouette cameo. Um, and I love how it turned out. I actually used the um, Forever Young paper uh, by Mint Tay. Um, and I love that paper line. So what I did was just mix those two papers and then the shimmer pink paper here is an Anna Griffin paper Which I love her cardstock is super thick um, And then the little bows that I created right there. I use this die here by uh, Magnolia doohickeys and it's just this double bow here. I Love that die um, and then um, this uh, glitter um, fabric here is actually a fabric that I ordered from I think it's called glitter oh gosh I'll put it down in the description box if I remember but I love the sparkle on that if you guys can see it I just added some sticker from the like magic um, paper line and then I cut this out of the paper and just fussy cut it I love how this turned out and so inside I just have a few little embellishments that I created and so um, I like this because you can really fill it up with goodies. I've seen where some folks have actually used it for an embellishment swap. So I thought that was super cute. 
Um, but what I did was I finally, guys, again, made some laminated tags. And so the dye that I used for this was, again, one of the AliExpress dyes that I got from Alina Crafts. This is another one of my favorite um, dyes. And so I just made a tag at some layers there, a uh, little chipboard piece that says friends, some really pretty sparkly ribbon there. And yeah, so that's the first tag. And then the second tag is just this one here. They're really similar. Again, just added some chipboard pieces. This one says all smiles. And as you can see, just have some of that sequence there, um, all to kind of match the colors that I created today. So I really, again, love how this turned out. I thought that the paper was really pretty and I can't wait to fill this up with some goodies here. So, okay. So lastly, um, I would say this was probably my favorite project out of all. All right, so here is the last project that I created, guys. Oh my gosh, I really love how this turned out. It was so fun to create. I cre uh, cut this SVG file out on my silhouette and yes, use that uh, Mente paper, Forever Young, and I did a mixture. So this is all, uh, I think this little chipboard here is actually from the Dulce paper. But isn't that super, super cute? This bow here is one that I also cre um, cut out on my silhouette. This was so fun to make. And I'm trying to get into really using my um, machine so that I can do some, uh, use the, the SVG files more. Um, I added a sticker that says popcorn and treats there. It's very functional. This top comes off. And then what I did was I just made some little, um, I tried my hand on the little, um, cotton candy embellishments. So I have those kind of stuck down in there, um, real fun with like some little lollipop uh, cabochons there. And yes, yeah, so cute. So you can fill this up with goodies and give this to one of your uh, crafty friends. Uh, I like that little ledge there. You can add something to it. I created this um, balloon um, um, set up here from a punch. And so I just punched it out and double layered it a couple times, added some tool there. And yes, super, super cute. I love how that turned out. Um, so that is all of my projects today, guys. Thank you so much for uh, tuning in. And if you are not a subscriber, please do subscribe and go ahead and turn on your notification so that you will know when I upload another video. As I mentioned in my previous video, I am back. I am excited about creating. And also I will leave my information for my other social outlets, such as my Instagram. So you guys can go over and check out my Instagram. I hope you guys are having a fantastic day and I will talk to you in my next video. Bye guys.